And hello YouTube and welcome back to another episode of The Zone TV Movie Entertainment with me, your host Jonathan, once again bringing you another trailer reaction and review for the final trailer for War of the Planet of the Apes. Now this is the third movie in the so-called reboot franchise of the Planet of the Apes series, so let's check it out. I didn't get to see it this morning, so let's check it out. I'm kind of excited, Matt Reeves directing this movie, so Andy Serkis is back, let's check it out. I like how they're using guns now, that's so cool. Yes. Child. I don't know. Well, but she was you. She has no one else. We are not savages. Apes fight only to survive. Bad human kill apes. We're all dead now for a long time. These movies just get better and better as they keep making them. I think the story obviously looks like this could... It looks like it's focusing on saying that maybe this could be the end of Caesar. Maybe he will die or maybe eventually he's gonna, you know, re realize that humans are all bad and he's gonna have to do something. Maybe he takes the fact that his, whatever his apes are on his side left because it looks like there are certain apes... Um, on the human side, Woody Harrison either convinced them, you help us, we'll spare your lives, or whatever. Maybe the other apes decide, like, listen, Caesar's not really listening to us, you know, maybe these humans don't get it, you know. Uh, who knows, but um, I think it looks incredible. Caesar looks great, obviously. I mean, I don't think he's going to die. I'm taking a guess here. I don't think he'll die. I think he's going to, something's going to happen where he's going to either turn on everybody and on his side, of course. I mean, obviously on the humans. And they rage war with them. And this is going to continue. You know? I mean, it's just a guess. But I don't know. I, I do like um, the, the tone of the movie. It looks incredible. Um, negatives about it? Uh, I feel like the story is kind of like the same how uh, Dawn was, kind of. Where, yes, Caesar's trying to protect the family. And, um, you know, he wants to be in peace. But then all, the, all of a sudden... You have the humans trying to get in, you know, in touch with Caesar, and maybe try to convince him to stop doing it. And the other apes are trying to be like, "Listen, man, these humans they don't care about us. They want to kill us, but you keep thinking that they're, they're, you know, they're still good in these humans." And we all know he's been raised, you know, to kind of like humans because certain humans from the last two movies liked him and they were friends with him. So I don't know. I feel like that's a weird pattern that continue with this. But hopefully, maybe Caesar realizes that, hey, listen, you know, my eight brothers are right. You know, maybe these humans, they don't like us anymore. We need to get rid of them now. 
maybe they're gonna... Like I said, I don't know. Maybe Caesar will die in this movie. Maybe he won't. I'm still looking forward to seeing this movie, like I said. And I think Matt Reeves did a great job with the the tone of the movie. And, you know, gives us something to look forward to. I'm, I'm curious in how this movie's gonna end. I mean, it looks like with that little girl in the trailer, it looks like they're gonna take care of her like how Caesar was taking care of when he was a baby ape, a young ape. So maybe it'll be the opposite of that. So maybe something will blossom there. Maybe she'll be the ambassador for them one day. Who knows? But I like it. I can't wait. So leave a comment below. Let me know what you guys thought about the trailer. If you saw it and um, what do you thought about it? And um, did you like it? And are you looking forward to it? So and also, you think Caesar's gonna die? Leave a comment below. Let me know what you guys think. Thank you and have a good day.